if two universes collide, they could both be destroyed, they could be pinched into nothingness. However, if the collision was relatively mild, it could, for example, leave a bruise in the very oldest light we can see in the universe, the so-called cosmic microwave background. So there is a chance that if a collision happened in the past of our universe, we might be able to search for its imprint or its signature in this ancient light. This work is kind of underway, but there is a lot more to be done to get more data that characterize better the polarization of this cosmic microwave background. Once that data is in hand, we would be able to carry out this test and see if we can spot a signal like that. The, the signal, you can think about it as the intersection of two spheres is a sort of circular patch. And this circular patch would be in a particular direction in the sky, and it would have a certain profile in its temperature within the background light that I was talking about. So it would not look that weird. Um, and it is actually quite interesting statistical problem to be able to extract that signal out of all of the other patches of hot and cold spots that you see in the cosmic microwave background. But we have developed algorithms to do that exercise. So we can't really wait to get this data and carry out this test. We have to wait for very high fidelity, very accurate polarization data for, from the cosmic microwave background over very large portions of the sky. So maybe in another decade or so. Unfortunately, it's not going to be tomorrow. <laughs>